Right, welcome to our third and final video for this topic of symmetry. Today's lesson, we are going to look at making symmetric figures and patterns. So before we start, let's again recap what symmetry means. Basically, if this figure is symmetric, what that means is it, it has a line of symmetry, an imaginary line of symmetry, where it divides the figure into two equal halves, and these two equal halves will fit exactly when folded. Okay. Now for this part, you will need to take out your worksheet. So for the first example, the figure below is half a symmetric figure. You are required to complete the figure with the dotted line as the line of symmetry. So this E shape here, the figure here, is half a symmetric figure. This is the line of symmetry. We are supposed to complete it on this side. Okay. So what you need to do is take out your color pencil or blue pen and start shading. Okay. So remember, line of symmetry means that the two halves are equal halves and they will meet they will fit exactly. So if I have one, two, three, four, five, six boxes here, I should have six boxes over on the other side. So likewise if I have boxes all the way down, it should follow all the way down here and for this middle part here, notice it's only one, two, three, four, five. So this part here should be blank. Okay? So this is how you should be coloring it. So let's start one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, all the way down. And one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so color it properly. And for the middle part, I will leave that one box blank. Okay, so I color all the way here. Yep, so this is my symmetric figure completed symmetric figure. Now let's look at the second part here. Now the second part is where you need to do it on your own. So your job for this part is to create a symmetric figure with the dotted lines as the line of symmetry. So you can use this as an example. All right. So it should look something like this. And I will leave it up to you how creative you want it to be. So all you need to do is just shade some boxes. Okay, so shade some boxes. So if I shade this like that, so this is half of the symmetric figure, and then the other half will look something like this. Okay, all right. So these two halves are symmetric figure because on this side I have one, two, three, four, on this side one, two, three, four, and two rows. All right. Obviously, this is a very simple example, and I don't expect to see anyone with this you come up with your own symmetric figure. Clear? Now if you turn your worksheet around, you will actually see something like this. Okay, a square, this is a square grid. And you will see some of the, some sh uh, half of symmetric figures. Okay, and this is one of the example that you will see in your worksheet. So what you need to do, again, similarly, just like the other example, you are supposed to complete this uh, symmetric figure where this is my line of symmetry. So all you need to do is grab a ruler and your pencil or pen okay, and complete it. So again, line of symmetry means that uh, the two halves are equal and they will fit exactly. So if this is like that, okay, so it will be a, like a mirror reflection on the other side like this. So it should look something like this. okay, And this straight line here will be reflected exactly here and finally this line here will be from here to here okay so I've actually completed my symmetric figure so you see if, uh, from this spans two boxes and it goes up one box so this one across two box goes up one box this is this line comes down three boxes this line should also come down three squares or and same with this, it goes up across two squares and up one square. So that's why the line is like that. So basically what you need is a figure that is symmetric because it this half, the two halves are equal and it will fit exactly. Okay, so I've already shown you one example. So your job is to fill up the other four and bring it back to class and let's continue to talk about it in class. Alright, so that's it. Um, that's all that we need to learn for creating symmetric figures. 
the concepts are simple. So just remember, line of symmetry means that two equal, there are two equal halves, and the two halves will fit exactly. Okay, see you back in class.